Styles, where we post it every Friday. See them corner emojis, then you know it's wild. I'm a Jada Gemini to the day I die, and I'ma talk my sh but I don't play both sides. So nah. And Charlamagne was like, bro, you the most hood nigga in here, bro. What? They was like, bitch, you got on a fucking wife beater. Yeah, that's what Keith, he was like, bro, you got a wife beater. And like, I'd have been like, bro, you're a like, hood ass real you estate scammer, cut bitch it out. ass nigga. Don't you got a Rico? Here, let me show way? y'all this before we go. Real estate Rico. I need to see the proof. God damn, bro. Bankruptcy. Hold on, that's too far left. Damn, DJ Envy. Oh, God. Oh, no. Caesar Pena. Not Jennifer the trap. Pena. Land trap lord. Not again. Rashawn Casey is DJ Envy. His name is Rashawn. Why he got his arms like that? <laughs> Why he trying to look all hard, bro? They need them to comply. And they subpoenaed their request to stop capping and comply. Or else. Oh my god, dude. Two beige niggas in the forest. <laughs> <laughs> like, what are y'all doing, bro? Oh god. Some of the bankruptcy judge said you need to hand it over. A judge has threatened DJ Envy of the syndicated <laughs> hip hop show The Breakfast Club. If he doesn't comply with the subpoena in a bankruptcy involving accused fraudster, Caesar Humberto. Jesus. Pina, aka the the niggas that ran down on Joe Button at the fucking <laughs> at the pizzeria, dog. DJ Envy has until January the eighth to produce all the documents requested by a court appointed trustee overseeing Pena's company since it was forced into bankruptcy by creditors four months ago. If he doesn't, he could be arrested and taken to bankruptcy court in New Jersey she. for a mandatory deposition and possibly face other sanctions. Damn. Rick, hey, Rick Ross about to be pickleball paddling but your wife. Rick Ross is, you know what's funny? Rick That's Ross crazy. is sitting back. And I'm not trying to blame know, nobody for nothing. As soon as bro get got, Rick Ross is going to swoop in there like Clark Kent with the pickleball paddle in hand and just I'm gonna say this real quick. Wait, I'm not gonna blame Envy nobody. Seven sons. No, seriously, because he did touch a nerve with DJ Envy. God. So I'm gonna say this: he's not scared to talk his shit. So that's how I know. He gonna be at. They gonna be at car shows, bruh. Polishing four Giatos. <sighs> I just know that he gonna be talking his mess when it's safe, and he's not gonna be talking his mess when it's not. And honestly, he been real quiet. And I feel like he looking at Diddy. He looking at all these. Other, he's like, bro, I'm not trying to. I, the car show over. It's Christmas. I'm not trying to ruffle no feathers. I'm not trying to beef with Fifty. I'm not trying to be. I'm not trying to do none of that. Yeah. Meanwhile, DJ Envy getting strung out by the Fed. That's what I'm saying. I don't think he's about to be involved in this. There's some low-key Fed dig, though, too, because, you know, this is one of the moves that the Feds make where it, it's chess, not checkers. You got multiple agencies watching his move right now. If he's not already mm -hmm, working, mm -hmm. working and complying with one, the other's trying to force his hand right now because they're doing some emergency Ooh. bankruptcy. I'm about to ask you a question right now. Hit me, So, baby. shout out to um, Sienna. Why are you always you stirring think, shit up, dog? No, listen, listen, listen. Do you think Charlemagne snitched already? Yes. <laughs> yes. It's a pig's ass pork. Okay, that's all I wanted to ask. I'm sorry. Come that's on, That's all I wanted man. to ask, bro. That's all I wanted. Because honestly, oh, man. I think he snitched like back in October.